Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. But before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's Montecito neighbor has publicly slammed the Duke and Duchess of Sussex and claimed his attempts to be neighborly were snubbed. United States Navy veteran Frank McGinnity has been neighbors with the Sussexes since they first moved into the exclusive area back in 2020. However, Mr. McGinnity, 88, claimed his attempts to be neighborly and introduce himself to the couple failed after he was turned away. The Navy veteran said he tried to welcome Harry and Meghan to the area by lending them some movies he created about the history of the land on which their house is now built. Harry and Meghan live on Old McCormick property, and I went up to their gate with the films on a CD, but they weren't interested, he told the local newspaper Montecito Journal in an excerpt from his book on travel, called Get Off Your Street. The gate guy turned me away and wouldn't take the film, just saying they're not interested. I was trying to be neighborly. If they were interested in the neighborhood, I'd got a lot of information. Ironically, one of Prince Harry's major causes as a royal was helping wounded veterans through the Invictus Games. The newspaper went on to reveal that Mr. McGinnity's property is just a tireless toss or two from Meghan and Harry's property line. The Sussexes originally snapped up the 16-bedroom estate in the exclusive California suburb for about odd $21 million in June 2020. Megan has previously called the sprawling residence calm and healing and ultimately makes the Duchess feel free. We did everything we could to get this house, she told New York Magazine in 2021. Because you walk in and go, joy, and exhale, and calm, it's healing, you feel free. Despite also being home to A-listers like Oprah Winfrey, 69, Mr. McGinnity said it was surprising that the Sussexes chose to base themselves in the neighborhood, which is mostly older people. We don't see them very much around here, he said. It's surprising they came here. People are typically older. It's where the elephants come to die. So what do you think about this news, guys? Thank you for tuning in to today's discussion. As always, I encourage you to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Stay tuned for more updates on the intriguing world of royalty. Until then, thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more fascinating news about the royal family. Thank you.